Wild guys are about to react to a new video. Ron Paul went on the view and he completely destroyed them when it came to gun control. I need you guys to stick along to the back end of the video. So what I gotta say about it. But right now, I need you guys to like, comment, subscribe if you're new. And as always, you have to react to. About to get right to it. The difficulty is background checks. I don't object to background checks. And you just say, well, why don't we close the loophole of the private transactions? So they did that in California. They closed the loophole, and it's illegal to have a private transaction. Yeah. But in San Bernardino, it still happened. Why? Because in order to police private uh, transactions and have background checks, uh -huh. you would have to know where all the guns are all the time. And so what we fear is not the registration. I think you'll find this from most pro-gun people. We don't fear the, the, background, uh, the background checks. We fear that you would have to register all guns in order to know if it, to have a background so, check. I just want to ask you this because I'm a gun owner. You know, I don't mind that you know that I have a gun. You can come in my house and look for you. You can get off whatever you need. I don't understand why anyone objects to getting rid of automatic weapons. Automatic weapons, they're not for hunting. They do nothing. They're not, they're only there to kill. And you'll notice that a lot of the things that have happened happen with automatic weapons. When we see that, why don't we say, you know, who really needs to have one other than people who are at, at war? Yeah, what is Truly automatic weapons we don't have. You know, we ban truly automatic weapons, I think, in 1934. Right, but we still got a lot of them, right? Come yeah, on well, now. what we have is not automatic weapons, so we have semi-automatic. So they fire in a fairly fast sequence, but you can't pull the trigger and they come like a machine gun. Those are, okay. those are no longer but out. But you know what I'm saying. Yeah. You know what, what it I'm is, saying. is that there's a, a repetitive fire. Uh -huh. People do hunt with them, and people do also uh, shooting and sport shooting and uh, target shooting and things with these guns. And come to Kentucky, and I'll introduce you. To it. There are a lot of people who like and enjoy this as a sport. Board. But the other problem is, is if we're going to take away ownership of specific types of guns, you really have to modify it. something that big as to either be legislation or even possibly a constitutional amendment. We can't allow one individual to do it. And here, I'll give you an example why. Let's say we had a terrible president that you didn't like from another party, and that president said, the view, oh, you should hear the things they're saying on the view, we should limit their speech, we should register the journalists, and then we should have an approval board. And you know, we, that's silly. We would all be opposed to that. One thing about Whoopi Goldberg, she's going to keep pushing that agenda that she needs to push. Oh, get the automatic weapons, get the automatic weapons. After she was corrected that there's not automatic weapons everywhere, they're semi-automatic. She went right back to it. Get the automatic weapons, get the automatic weapons. I can tell you what, big or small, my gun collection, you're not getting a piece of it. Whoopi Goldberg believes we live in a such perfect world, which is not true. Tyranny is possible. That's why we need our weapons. Let me know what you guys think. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe if you're new. And as always, let me know what to react to. We're out.